what's in the old mailbag? That next on Geocaching with some rules. Okay, so the following is a bunch of clips from November and December stuff I've uh, received in the mail, so here we go. Well, it's uh, November 14th, 15th today, and we got a pass tag in the mail, and there's an envelope, and then inside the envelope was pretty much taped a uh, card. It looks like this card's been used a couple times, and tape inside that was the pass tag. And there it is. And we get a good shot in this. It's a, an alien serving drinks from the looks of it. SMMI caches. Yeah, pretty neat little cache. Or pass tag. <laughs> So, there it is, uh, a little closer up shot, and uh, this is what it uh, looks like on the uh, computer. And this tag is the brainchild of six geocachers from the southwest Michigan area, Team Geo Chief, T.S. Moly, Mold Slug, and the Wandering Weirdos, Cal Vexi, and Binder Guy. Bindery guy. <laughs> we all decided at the Midwest Geobash 2009 to camp together in, air, air, in Area 51 during the Midwest Geobash 2010. So, coins be out there for a while. This actually came from uh, Nova Scotia, so it's made its way from Michigan to Nova Scotia and then to uh, Ontario. <laughs> well, November, December 4th. And we got a, a new, uh, looks like a path tag, gonna be a path tag in here. Get this all cut up. And inside it is a Texas coin. And it's from Leanne from T Temple, Texas, but I, uh, not expecting a uh, <laughs> coin. For, and it looks like one I already got here. Which is this one, Italy to U.S. by Finley. Uh, if that's the same coin, because I know they had two coins and they sent me the wrong one, but they gave me the code for to log the right one and got it fixed up. So I'm gonna have to log this one to see what's going on. Yeah. So this is another coin. It's not the same as the other one, so oh, thanks to uh, Leanne for sending it off. Now I have uh, both her uh, Italy to U.S. coins. It's uh, close up on it. That's it for today. Ooh, great. Hey, it's December 5th, and we got a parcel in the mail from uh, Cashers Corner Store. And if you watch my videos, you probably remember I won a $25 gift certificate uh, back at the LNA Mega event. So it expires on December 13th, or 31st, so I thought I'd better uh, order some stuff. So I had her open here. And That's the receipt. So, first thing I grabbed is three little nanos in uh, green, silver, and black. Just uh, nice to hand have these sitting at the side in the truck in case I run across one that needs to be replaced. And then we got Santa Grinch. 
or Santa Zombie, I guess. And then uh, this one is uh, actually from Land Sharks, uh, and it's a geocoin. It was actually on clearance, and it had to do with the uh, eclipse. So it's a total eclipse of your heart. The song. So that's. It. Didn't I get anything for the eclipse? Oh yeah, I did get an eclipse. But I eh, thought this was pretty cool, so grabbed it. So that took care of my twenty-five dollar gift certificate, plus uh, probably the same amount in shipping. So it ended up costing me about the same. <laughs> That's it for today. Well, December seventh, and we got a parcel in from land sharks Let's see what we got I think I did some Christmas shopping for myself <laughs> okay so right off the bat there's a coin and trackable at geocaching.com with signal around a Christmas tree and this looks pretty cool. Little baggy. Oh, I know what this is. It's a little Canadian Canadian uh, Christmas ornament with a Canada 150 on it, and it is uh, trackable too. So I'll make a, a copy of those two trackables and uh, may hang this on my tree. Not sure yet. It might just go in my display case. And the uh, holiday ammo can. Um, they're a part of the get one free geocaching holiday trackable. So free trackable for ordering over. Uh, $25 was it? Yeah, $25. So that's it for today. Well, it's uh, December 12th. <laughs> what day is it? Um, I've got another parcel in the mail today. And that's what I think it is. It is treasure. If you don't know what treasure is treasure is a movie with a quite a bit of geocaching in it and it deals with a, a troubled teen that uh, goes to a center and hooks up with a, a person in there that's geocaching and she finds a, a new friendship based on love for geocaching so that was a movie in 2017 brought out uh, straight to uh, um, Blu-ray. So uh, we're gonna have uh, I think we're gonna have a, another movie night for H Nag and uh, play this movie for everybody to come see and uh, hopefully everybody will enjoy it. Uh, a lot of reviews from geocachers saying it's. Uh, Pretty damn good movie. <laughs> so that's it for today. Okay. Today in the mail, we got a letter size envelope from uh, Scott Miller from uh, Postmarked is Santa Barbara, but he's in Ohio, California. And open it up. A letter and he's got my email and what's in here is uh, a Geo Woodstock discover geocaching.com ambassador coin uh, 
thanks Scott for uh, sending that out to me. So Scott's uh, another uh, videographer. That's his uh, YouTube channel, Scott Ohio Videos. He geocaches under GSMX2. And he's uh, out in California and does some pretty cool videos with uh, 360 degree angles. Uh, 360 degree camera and he's also one of the main moderators in the uh, Geos Woodstocks for uh, 2018 in Cincinnati so if you're going to Geo Woodstock stop by the uh, Geos Woodstock 2018 community group and check out what's going on if you're Canadian and uh, going to Geo Woodstock Check out our uh, Geo Woodstock 2018 Canadian Invasion page, and it's geared towards Can Canadians going to uh, Cincinnati this uh, May, and we have uh, people from uh, Geo Woodstock committee on the uh, the uh, in the group to answer your questions, plus other Canadians. So, uh, Scott. It's actually registered to Scott, so I uh, asked him for permission to put in the uh, tracking code here. So he said, go ahead and uh, discover it. Just uh, if you discover it, say uh, found it on uh, Sim Rebels uh, video. That's it uh, for today. Okay, it's uh, December 15th, and we got mail. This one's from uh, Hello Sweetie. Nice little uh, tag with uh, Doctor Who uh, TARDIS on it. So, okay, and this is called Regeneration, and it's a uh, Doctor Who 2006. Uh, coin and then it's, remember the uh, show lots of lights and stuff uh, going on when uh, Doctor Who regenerated back in one of the episodes and the next thing come in this is from AFK Geocoins uh, geocoinfactory.com and open this up it's coming in a nice little box here. Open that up. AFK Juicing, activate. And there it is. And it's a Christmas 27 Crystal Geocoin. Actually, we can see it here, it lights up and changes color. So, so I'm going to put this on the Christmas tree and hang it up. Pretty cool. So that's a uh, geocaching factory and they have a clear white one and then they have the multicolored one and one that doesn't light up at all so. and since they're all the same price I got the one that light up multicolors <laughs> well it's December 22nd and I got another parcel in the bag a parcel in the mail <laughs> okay uh, I thought hopefully this would be my last uh, entry for this, but I'm still waiting for one more thing. So let's see what today brings us. Today is Geo Fleas. Along for the ride. And if you haven't seen these, these uh, Geo Fleas, they uh, are colorful, nice little tags, and they attach to your trackables or other trackables so yeah. and they go along for the ride and it has your uh, 
geocache name on there, some rebel. So I attach these to all my uh, geocaches, or not my geocaches, all my trackables before I send them out and I kind of give that personalized touch to them. So that's it for today. Uh, we got one more thing coming in the mail. I thought it would have been here by now, but uh, that would be after Christmas since there's no more mail. Well, they're mail tonight, today, so it might come in today, and but I won't do the video till after Christmas. Well, it's uh, December 28th, getting close to the end of the year and close to ending this uh, November, December video. Today we got a envelope in the mail from uh, Katie Giulio from Geocaching Headquarters. And I know what this is. I'm kind of waiting for this. Oh, it's hard to do one handed. The anticipation. You. There it is. The new Magic the Gathering trackable tag. Magic. I long. Uh, so this is one I got from Geocaching Headquarters, and I should be getting another one uh, from Geo Gearheads that I won from them. So I'll have two of these tags to match the two tags I got from the earlier promotion that I won. So we'll uh, see if that comes in in the next couple days, or this might be the end of this. Well, there's our. Uh... Christmas tree, a star, and we have a couple uh, geocaching balls here that uh, daughter-in-law Nadine picked up last year for us, uh, gave us for Christmas from uh, Brunners, and then over here we have the land shark. Snowflake, and go ahead and if you want to discover that, I'll put the number up here, and then uh, also the uh, Signal the Frog lighted LED crystal that changes color, and if you can't see the tracking number, I'll put it up here, and Nadine also bought for her mom a uh, cat lover. Uh, that's from uh, Broner's over in Frankenmuth, uh, the two geocaching balls. And they have a geocache over there in the parking lot, actually, too. So one of these years, we're going to get over to Frankenmuth. And that's it for De November and December mail. Uh, I thought you, I'd update you on uh, my little travel bug race. Uh, watch my videos you know I won the uh, geocaching challenge earlier in the year and I got uh, I guess it was last year <laughs> anyways got a couple of uh, travel bugs off of uh, cash advance for uh, prizes and instead of having her mail it I had her drop them in a cache and we're uh, I put them in a race on TB run to uh, come to me. So here's an update. So the clownfish looks like it's the closest at 229 kilometers. And it's been stuck in a travel bug hotel for 222 days though. So I guess I did get these last year. And then the other one is the bunny cashkins and it's 1220 kilometers but it was put into a travel bug hotel in 15 days ago so the uh, clownfish started off over in Washington State and it's been all over it's been up to Montreal and close to Montreal well, it wasn't over into Canada so it must have been on the New York side here and now it's sitting way down in uh, this puzzle challenge which 
inches. In New York, St. Lawrence County, New York. And then uh, the bunny cashkins. It uh, started in Washington, went out east, went back to freaking Washington, and now it's way down in Atlanta. <laughs> Or Georgia someplace <laughs> so who knows which one's going to make it to uh, back to me so I hope everybody had a good Christmas and all the best to everyone in uh, 2018 uh, videos uh, probably start in the first of the week uh, we have a uh, couple of events going on so uh, probably have a we have a wrap-up coffee event on the 31st to get our souvenir and then uh, there's a couple of events on the first but I'm not sure if I'm gonna make either one one's at seven o'clock in the morning an hour and a half drive out in the cold and it doesn't appeal to me um, I'll be in bed till 10 <laughs> and the next one's uh, in the afternoon up in London uh, may depending on the weather get out to it if not I'll just go grab a cash for the first of the year to get my souvenir so all the best in 2018 and cash you later and cash you on the trails